searching for phone numbers in IMAP. So the first thing we're going to do is go up here to the top of the page and click on Tax Search. And then we're going to click Owner Name and we're going to change it to Phone Number. And then because phone numbers, it doesn't, you know, they can have all manner of different area codes, but it doesn't matter anywhere in the world where they're at. We're going to use contains because it doesn't matter anywhere in the world where they're at. They always have a dash. So I'm just going to put a dash in there. And then a good use case for this would be to say, as an example, I don't, I'm, I'm, I'm looking for homes that haven't had a sale in five years or more. So I'm going to click on the calendar. I'm going to click today's date. I'm just going to change this 2020 to 2015. I'm going to say less than or equal to. So I want all my sales to be before 2015 that I'm looking at. And I'm going to give it a single family home and say start search. And it looks like right now we're pulling up over 5,000 properties with a phone number attached.